in this video we will learn basic concept of arithmetic progression so first we will see what is arithmetic progression arithmetic progression in short it is also called ap ap it is made up of two words arithmetic and progression and what is arithmetic arithmetic is is a branch of mathematics that deals with numbers and this is the first branch of mathematics and this is what we have learned all along in our primary and nursery level and also we have some chapters of arithmetic in subsequent classes as well but this is something which is very basic dealing with numbers dealing with numbers that is 1 2 3 4 5 6 fractions etc this is what is arithmetic and progression progression means it is something which is like progressing or moving forward moving forward is progression so progression comes from the word progress so moving forward and what is arithmetic progression arithmetic progression is basically series of numerical terms that means number terms which are going forward in a pattern which is going forward in a pattern say for example we say 1 2 3 4 5 now this is basic counting which you have learned in nursery now this is where the numbers are going forward in a pattern and what is that pattern that every consecutive number every suc successive number is increased by one so there is a increase of value by one similarly if we have a series like 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. So here the increase is by value 2 and this can also be called as the series of even numbers. So these are what? even numbers and this was what first was simple counting counting similarly we will have series of odd numbers like 1 3 5 7 so if we have like 1 3 5 7 9 and it can be so on it is not necessary so this is series of odd numbers odd numbers so these are the three simple example of arithmetic progression in real life also for example you started studying and you were in class 1 then you moved to class 2 and so on so there has been a progression so this is like arithmetic progression from class 1 you move to class 2 from class 2 you move to class 3 from class 3 you move to class 4 still since till you reach to class 10 now so that is also an arithmetical progression in your studies similarly when we want to climb we use staircase and in staircase also we go up step by step 
सो स्टेर केस और ए लेडर इज एन एग्जाम्पल ऑफ अरिथमेटिक प्रोग्रेशन सो टिपिकली लेट एस समराइज वट इज अरिथमेटिक प्रोग्रेशन अरिथमेटिक प्रोग्रेशन इज सीरीज ऑफ टर्म्स एंड द डिफरेंस बिटवीन द टू कंजिक्यूटिव टर्म्स इज सेम सो द डिफरेंस बिटवीन द टू कंजिक्यूटिव टर्म्स लाइक थ्री एंड वन इज सेम फाइव एंड फाइव एंड सेवन इज सेम सेवन एंड नाइन इज सेम सो एनी टाइम हियर द डिफरेंस इज द डिफरेंस इज टू वेर एज इन द फर्स्ट केस द डिफरेंस वॉज वन देर कुड बी अनदर सीरीज लाइक टेबल ऑफ फाइव फाइव टेन फिफ्टीन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फाइव सो दिस यू कैन से सीरीज ऑफ टेबल ऑफ फाइव दिस इज ऑल्सो एन अरिथमेटिक प्रोग्रेशन and here the difference is 5 and this difference is also called common difference because it is same between the two consecutive terms so it means how we can get the second term is say we have 5 and then if we add 5 to it we will get 10 then we add another 5 to this we will get 15 and then we add 5 we get 20 you remember when you were a child and when you were not able to recall your tables you were answering by adding so you just keep on adding and you can answer the question so that is what actually you were learning at that point of time arithmetic progression and in arithmetic progression we can write the terms as a1 a2 a3 a4 A five and so on, and it can go up to A n, like an nth term. So the first term, second term, third term. So it means how the second term A two will be equal to A one plus difference D. So difference this is written as D. By convention, the terms are represented by the alphabet. in lower case as a and the common difference as d so the second term will be a1 plus d third term will be a3 will be a1 plus 2d so it means we can write and the fourth term will be a1 plus 3d so we can write the series as a1 a2 a3 a4 a5 or we can also write a1 plus d and then we can write a1 plus 2d and then we can write a1 plus 3d and then first we can write a1 so we can also write like this this is the first term a1 then this is the second term and this is the third term and so on this is the fourth term so this is fourth and the difference is denoted as d so what have we learned so far we have learned what is arithmetic progression it is basically a series of numerical terms that is and the difference between two consecutive terms is same and therefore by adding the difference from the previous term we can get the succeeding term so it's a very simple concept arithmetic progression as such is a very simple concept it is number of terms arranged in a pattern where the difference is same and that difference is called common difference and is denoted by letter d and the terms are denoted written as a1 a2 a3 etc and nth term is represented as an by convention when we are talking of the first term sometimes we don't write one so we just simply write a so a if we say a this is the first term first term so any arithmetical progression is defined by two parameters first is what is the first term 
and second thing is what is the common difference so it means what we need to do is we need to define what is a and what is d so if we define these two things then we are able to define the arithmetic progression thank you